Hey ladies and gentlemen, mostly ladies this time I think though. Steven here from Red Essence. welcome back to another video. So in today's video, we're gonna be discussing my five favorite Parfum de Marly fragrances for women for the fall and winter. As I'm sure many of you know, Parfum de Marly has a lot of excellent fragrances, some of which are, uh, I think, catered towards the hotter weather. Some of them do really well in the colder weather. So today we're gonna be focusing our attention on the ones that I think are going to do spectacularly well in the colder weather. So make sure to stay tuned. Before I begin this video and I tell you all about these five fragrances by Parfum de Marly for women for the colder weather and why I think they would do so well in the colder weather, I do want to mention that if you are a fan of fragrance related content, if you like fragrance reviews, top lists and more here on YouTube, please do consider supporting this channel by subscribing to it. Make sure to enable all notifications by clicking on the bell icon and give this video a thumbs up if you find this video helpful in any way or if you took anything of value from this video today. I also wanna mention before I get on with the list that if you are interested in sampling the numbers three, two, and one fragrances in this list, you may do so by purchasing my Max Aroma bundle for the month of November. So if you do get the bundle, you will be supporting the channel and it does include all three of my top three fragrances with a funnel. It's the lipstick uh, type atomizer, which I think is really cool. And there's eight mLs in each one. I think the price is incredibly fair. And this way you can get a chance to sample uh, these fragrances before you commit to buying a bottle. I also think, especially since it is the holiday season now coming up, I think this would be a great way to purchase a discovery set for your significant other if you have a special woman in your life and you would like for her to smell amazing while also sampling my three favorites from uh, Parfum de Marly for women. So. Thank you so much for supporting. If you do decide to support, I'm gonna leave links to uh, the bundle down below and also links to all of the Parfum de Marly fragrances in this list. Uh, they're gonna be left down below. So let's go ahead and jump into the list. And the first fragrance that I wanna talk about is composed by Natalie Lorson. She has done fragrances like Encre Noir by Lalique. She's a very accomplished perfumer and she's also done another fragrance in this list with the help of another perfumer that I really admire. But the fragrance in the number one spot is called Meliora. So this fragrance opens up with red berries, cassis, black currant. There's a little bit of rose in here as well. It's very sensual, but it has that tart fruitiness in the opening, which I think comes across rather youthful, playful, sensual. It's not too serious or too mature or anything like that. So I think this would work really well. It also has a bit of a musky component as well, but it does smell very clean. I think this would be super appropriate for a woman in your life who is a little bit on the younger side. Maybe she is not necessarily looking for something very deep and mature and polished or anything like that. Although this does come across very refined, very polished, but it doesn't have a mature quality about it. The red berries are very tart. The cassis can also give off a bit of a musky vibe, but I'm really enjoying Meliora. Fantastic composition by Parfum de Marly. Beautifully done by perfumer Natalie Lorson. So I really enjoy this one. I would love to get my wife to wear this one more often. She wore it a couple of times and you know, she has her favorite, so it's hard to convince her, but every time she has worn this one, it has smelled awesome. And the performance on this one is also very, very good. The next fragrance that I wanna talk about is uh, one of my loves from this brand. And the moment I smelled this one, I fell in love with it. And it, it was a few years ago and it was through a sample. And since then I knew I had to purchase this one. And so, you know, my wife also doesn't wear this one too much, but I love wearing this one because I think it's a beautiful fragrance composed by Quentin Biche. And it has the rose, it has peony, it has lychee. You already know what it is. This one is Delina. This fragrance does not need an introduction, the beautiful pink bottle. You also have notes of Haitian vetiver in here. Uh, you have incense, cedarwood, and broxen, vanilla, cashmeron, musk. I mean, it's a beautiful, beautiful fragrance. Very smooth, very flirtatious, even more so than 
Meliora. Meliora is playful, but this one is sensual, hypnotizing. Um, definitely, if you want to stop men dead in their tracks, this is the type of fragrance that you're going to wear. There's also another one, Delina La Rose. That one I think is great for the hotter weather, but this one is perfect for the fall. And so if you're looking for something deeper, a little bit sweeter with that touch of rose and the vanilla, this one is an amazing fragrance to go with. And the next one is one that I think deserves a lot more praise in the community, and it does well, um, but I think it needs to be spoken about a little bit more. And this one is actually Darcy. So this one actually gets compared to a Chanel fragrance, Coco Mademoiselle Parfum. And this one has the rose and the patchouli and also sweet notes. And so it is sweet. It has a touch of vanilla in the base. I don't think vanilla is listed in the note breakdown. This one is part of my Max Aroma bundle. So this is my number three pick. So if you do get the bundle, you will be able to sample this one really professional. It has that executive CEO type of a quality about it. You mean business when you put this on, especially if you're wearing a really luxurious looking, expensive looking dress. This is the perfect complement to that. And so it has that very classy, refined, professional vibe. Whereas this one is playful. This one is very narcotic and, and uh, sensual. This one is very professional. You put it on, you're a confident woman. We know you mean business. And and of course, I said I really love Delina. Well, I also love Delina Exclusive. This is probably my favorite one of the bunch, especially for this time of the year. It's a no brainer, right? So Delina Exclusive, you have more of that really sensual, deep vanilla in the base. So all of the descriptors that I mentioned for the original Delina also apply to Delina Exclusive, but this one is even more sensual, even more mesmerizing. And I think in the you know, case that I would wear this one, the original Delina for the fall, I would wear this one for the fall and winter with emphasis on the winter. Delina Exclusive is an amazing, amazing fragrance. I'm a huge fan of it. And the fragrance in the number one spot is a new release also composed by Natalie Lorson, who did Meliora. And it was a collaboration between her and Hamid Marati Kashani, who is a perfumer I've had the pleasure of meeting in person. He and I actually did an event together at Saks Fifth Avenue in promotion of this upcoming fragrance. I think this one is jaw-droppingly good. It might be draws droppingly good for men, I suppose, as well. Uh, but this one is really, really good. This one is orange blossom, vanilla, and marshmallow. This one is Oriana. The bright magenta bottle, I think, conveys this, you know, feminine quality. It's, you know, bold, it's daring. This is an attention-getting fragrance. So whereas, you know, with the case of Delina Exclusive, you will get attention, but I can see somebody who's also a little bit more reserved wearing this one. This one is super um, extroverted, super playful. Um, doesn't have the executive CEO quality of Darcy, but I think if you are looking to get attention, you wanna be that woman where everybody's eyes and noses are gonna be on you Oriana is the fragrance to do that with. My wife loves this one. So my we've actually put a little bit of a dent in this bottle. There's probably about 10 milliliters missing, which is a lot because three sprays will last you the entire day. Very sensual, very flirtatious. I've done a review of Oriana, so if you are interested in checking that one out, I'm gonna leave a card up above, but all of these fragrances are absolutely exquisite. Parfum de Marly has some hits, and of course there's also Athalia and Sedbury and many, many others. I'm not even gonna get started. You know, Cassily is great, but I think that's great for all year round. But these are the five Parfum de Marly fragrances that I think are absolutely amazing for the fall and winter. All of them are available at Max Aroma. All of them are available in my Max Aroma bundle. You will get eight milliliters of each. The price is super fair. And this discovery set makes for an amazing gift. So it contains Darcy, Delina, and Oriana, some of the best sellers from the brand. Thank you so much for supporting. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do consider supporting this channel by subscribing to it. Make sure to enable all notifications by clicking on the bell and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Thanks again for watching. Love you all. Take care. We'll see you next time. Bye.